what I most remember is my uncle coming into my room and telling me to go outside and me looking back and seeing my mom crying and just thinking that he's dead. Well, in May of 2010, my husband passed away. Um, this is something that you never imagined it's going to happen. You know, when it happened, you feel, you feel alone. I felt kind of like an alien, like I was the only one who had been through this. So won't you leave for me a light outside your door? Almost 13 years ago, we started the Children's Bereavement Center so that kids and families would have a place to go where they could feel comfortable talking about loss and, and not feel that they were different from everybody else. Who's this bald guy? You. That very handsome bald guy. You. And who's that? I lost a lot of happiness that I got from her. It's just really hard. CBC has helped me get through many things. I feel much better. It made me understand that a lot more people have the same loss that I have. Loss in our community happens. It's a normal, natural experience. And when kids and families have loss, the center provides the resource that they need so they can feel normal again. The Children's Bereavement Center is kind of like another family, that knowing that a lot of other kids have gone through what I have gone through. I don't know, it's just comforting to go. For me, the CBC is it's kind of just like a big group of friends for me. The one thing that I do see from both my daughter and my son, the, the big difference that I see is the more openness to talk. It's so comforting to know that the Children's Bereavement Center is there for everyone. There's a 